NHS Lanarkshire has over 600,000 residents that we serve. We have t over 12,000 staff working in a range of three large acute hospitals and community sites as well. As we've seen from the commentary surrounding COP26, we need systemic and quite full change across all boards in Scotland, um, across all governments as well, in order to reach net zero. Obviously commuting has a huge impact on that, particularly when we consider staff and patient travel as well, which can't be overlooked. Some of those journeys will be essential, but we need to make sure as an organisation that we do that in the most sustainable fashion. ACEL and, and scoping has been really useful in actually just putting a metric to emissions from staff commuting. Um, it's insight that we didn't have before, but it's allowed us to have that figure to then track and manage over time. It also shows us where staff are commuting from and to. It allows us to then target strategically what sites we go after. Staff travel surveys have been interesting because it showed overwhelmingly that any staff journeys made have been via single occupancy car journey, which I think underlines the importance of what we're trying to achieve. As an organisation, we need to be able to communicate what we're doing, what facilities and resources are available to staff to make small changes in workplace that can add up over time. Some of the initiatives we've put in place to encourage staff to commute more sustainably have been some cycle parking, cycling infrastructure across our three large acute sites. We've also seen cycling infrastructure go into our community sites as well. That includes bike repair stands, cycle stands, heated town rails. We have plans to install more of those. I think one of the main benefits staff experience through Mobility Ways is the personalised travel plans. That's a, a huge benefit, it's never something we've been able to offer. Having that sort of automated through the platform is a huge benefit. Even speaking to the staff, I've heard many benefits from just improved mental health. They're getting to work refreshed, ready for the day. I would recommend Mobility Ways as a, a tool for all public bodies. It's a level of insight we've never had before. We're still quite early in, in that journey on Mobility Ways as a platform, but even still, it's been worth its weight in gold. I'm optimistic we can achieve zero carbon commuting. It won't be without its challenges, but there is a real appetite out there. We just need to be able to leverage that and, and deliver that.